I just do it right this time, you feel me? And I got the opportunity to make this right. Like, so I'm not taking on the same deals. I'm not taking the same money. I'm not taking the same, I'm not doing the same shows. Just because it's not doing nothing for me. Like, I already got what I got from it. You feel me? So now it's like time to elevate. So I've been already in the process of doing my own network and shit, uh, talking to these good partners or whatever about it, just fishing my options and shit to like be in a better position into what, like, you know. So like, yeah. So when you take a step back for real, you go through like this grace period, like this period when everything just still and stale, not stale and stale, but like just stale, like, you know, just like everything just, you feel me? Silence, like on purpose though. But while all that I'm getting mentioned, like it go from the biggest hater on the block to one of the most, I don't know, biggest people you can name for, you feel me? Niggas listening to me on their songs. I'm not talking about, I'm not talking about them mentioning me like, I'm talking about them mentioning me, not like, oh, they mentioning me like, uh, a couple months ago, or like when I first started, when I first blew up, or I'm talking about every other day or month periodically. You feel me? There's somebody's mentioning me, and I'm going through like what about you feel me? Like what about like moments when I'm just laid back but loaded up you feel me i'm in my loaded up era like i'm in this era when i'm not doing too much because I, it's a lot of shit i'm doing behind the scenes so i just want to say a big thank you you feel me that's it like that's it lit it has love for it too because I hold myself in a high standard. I ain't gonna hold you. I beat myself up more than y'all can beat me up. Like, uh, you feel me? Like, I said the worst shit to myself before I read it in the comments. Like, you feel me? Like, I'm just excited for, like, what I'm about to put out down. Like, everything that y'all waiting for is gonna be worth the wait, too. And then, plus... I feel like I gotta redeem myself. I ain't gonna lose you. This ain't this ain't the Krishan. Like like the Krishan. Like this ain't this ain't that. That's what I mean. Like I'm not even close to where I wanna be at. So it's like you feel me? I can't even uh But that's all I wanted to get up over here and say, you feel me? Pop my shit, say thank you. Oh yeah, the shit with Breakfast Club with um with Ray J. I see that. Um I don't know what he was talking about because I ain't hear nothing. I ain't get no conversation, you feel me? But, you know, I'm down to make some money. I'm down to see what the fuck going on. But I ain't doing the same shit. I ain't... You feel me? I ain't... I'm not doing the same shit. They go watch, but I ain't doing the same shit. Like, I'm doing something different. It's gonna be... Yeah, like that. But, yeah... You know, I'm just loaded up right now. I'm in this era when I'm just by myself in my little peace world, plotting, charting, putting shit, dating, praying, writing, recording. 
You feel me? Producing, making shit, like, just creating. Because y'all fuck with me. As soon as I put, like, a date up or anything, I'm sold out. Or, like, you know, booked and busy. So, as soon as I'm ready to work. Then I like this time that I got with my son. Like, I'm just with him. And just be a my son, be a my son, be a my son. So, yeah. He get bigger and bigger. So that's the cool part. And then I've been working out and shit. I play football now. I'm in my little element. That shit would be over ESPN. Like, I'm cool. I'm cool as fuck. So I just want to say thank you. This was the whole point of the live. To say thank you. Uh, <laughs> free my baby daddy. <laughs> Your, your, free blue. Uh, stay blessed, y'all. That's all I got to say. Stay out, stay out the way. And if you just focus on you, what's in your lane, it don't matter what's going on anywhere around you. Feel me? That's all that matters. And you just have fun. Cause at first, you know, I was at first, I was like. Said on a lot of negative shit, and it made me want to respond. It made me want to like pop my shit, but it's like, why would I even do that? You feel me? I just like y'all just talking shit. Just let y'all talk shit because that's what y'all like to do. Y'all like to talk shit, so I had to accept that. Like, oh, these niggas like to talk shit. Like, okay, they talk shit then, baby. So I'm letting y'all talk shit. Uh, if you got hate towards me or whatever, drop it. Because I don't know why you got that in your heart against me. So I bless it. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to pray for it. You feel me? I ain't even where he sparked it up. But, yeah, I ain't really like. I'm just thankful. Everybody just mentioned to me. That's it. Like, just imagine you just the most talked about motherfucker in the entire world. It's probably one of the coolest things, but one of the worst feelings. Like, it's the best thing because money-wise, business-wise, you can do a lot. You can accumulate a lot with that. But then dealing with the other shit that you'll talk to a therapist about all that shit is like it's a handful you feel me so you gotta be a real nigga to really survive <laughs> in this world shit cause life gonna keep life in and life is life in you feel me so yeah that's all I got to say um my bad this blood is kicking. But I'm going to call y'all later because I don't even call y'all like that. So I'm going to have to call you back. You feel me?